Hi there, this is Saeed and today I'm going to be talking about how to install Ubuntu 18.04 or any other Ubuntu easily and perfectly. Uh, installing Ubuntu is not a big deal but it can give you trouble if you do any wrong step or do anything wrong. So today I'm going to be talking about every single step in detail. So if you don't know anything about Ubuntu, if you don't know anything about Linux, then you can install it on your PC easily. All you need to do is follow my every single steps carefully and perfectly. Perfectly. Without any further ado, let's get started. So let's open ubuntu.com. I'll leave a link of that uh, site in the description below so you can download Ubuntu from there. So here you will see the download option. Just uh, click the download downloads and there you can see a green download button. And the bottom of this button, you will uh, see record made of uh, for installing Ubuntu. So just uh, hit the green button, download now, and not now, take me to the downloads, and your download will be started. After downloading Ubuntu, you have to download Power ISO. So I'll leave a link in the description below so you can download uh, your Power ISO. Here I'm gonna download uh, Power ISO 64 bit as I'm using 64 bit operating system uh, 64 bit processor and after downloading you have to open it or install it so I'm gonna install that power ISO so hit install and after installing just close it now you have to insert a USB drive USB pen drive and uh, minimum 4 GB USB pen drive is required for making bootable USB now you have to open the ISO file that you downloaded from Ubuntu web official website I need to open it with a power ISO if you don't see the power ISO application here you can uh, search uh, as I'm using the free version you have to wait uh, have to wait uh, four second and then hit continue unregistered and then you will see something like that uh, now you can uh, make a uh, usb with uh, this iso file uh, just uh, hit tools then create bootable usb and then hit ok and then you will see a window like that and then again you have to wait for a second and continue hit continue unregistered and then you will see that window and make sure right usb drive is uh, selected here and then hit the start button and uh, wait for it it gonna take some time and then after that just close it and now you can see it's uh, only 2 MB my uh, 32 GB pen drive showing now 2 MB it's not a problem I'll show you how to solve this how to format this drive in the end at the end of this video so don't worry now you have to restart your PC press a button for booting from your USB it's F12 for me it's maybe different for you it can be more complex if you are using an older motherboard then uh, you have to go to your uh, BIOS then change the boot menu boot order so after that you will see something like that uh, if you want to install that then you can install if you want to try ubuntu then you can select a try ubuntu and from there you have to select your keyboard layout as my keyboard layout is english then i'm going to select it and that hint continue if you are installing Ubuntu 18.04 then uh, there you will see two options normal install and minimal install. If you don't want uh, home anything uh, installed to your Ubuntu then you can hit uh, minimal install. As I have uh, enough space in my drive so I'm gonna select a uh, normal install. I will always recommend you to uh, select a normal install and you have to make sure that uh, your in internet connection is connected. You will see an option in the upper, upper right corner and from there you can uh, connect to your internet. Don't worry if you are unable to connect to your internet then you can escape it but connecting to internet is always a better option and uh, if your internet is connected select download updates while installing Ubuntu and install third party software for graphics Wi-Fi hardware and additional media formats so make sure you install select uh, both of them and then hit continue and here the most important part comes do not select any of them without 
something else you have to select something else then hit continue and there you will see list of drive here i have no drive just a free space for that i am seeing that if you want to create any drive additional drive from here you can do it from here i'm just showing you how to create a drive from here uh, it's not an important part So you can create drive you can see i have uh, created two drive here if you come from another version of ubuntu then um, you will see your uh, list of drive here and uh, if you want to install your ubuntu to your uh, previous drive uh, where you installed previous ubuntu or previous operating system then just uh, select the drive and then the minus button then uh, it will delete your uh, delete that drive and do not uh, delete other drive where you keep your personal or uh, data or folder or other files just delete the drive where you want to install ubuntu then make free space obviously you have to make free space and then select the free space then select the plus button then you will see a window like that set the size i will always recommend you to make uh, at least 30 gb ubuntu will work if you make uh, 12 or 15 gb but it is always recommended to make uh, at least uh, 30 gb to select a primary you can also select a logical doesn't matter but primary is recommended and the location for new partition you have to select uh, from beginning and use as from there uh, you have to select a ext4 generalizing file system and then the important part is mount point here you have to select forward slash do not select any of other thing just select forward slash and uh, from device from bootloader you don't need to do anything any change here just leave as it is here uh, it should show the full hard drive location by default it will it should be selected full hard drive location make sure that full hard drive location is selected here so after that uh, you can uh, hit the button install now and then you will see that uh, message it's gonna create format the following drive and partition after that just hit uh, continue then you will see option for uh, selecting location and just select your location uh, and then hit continue and fill up your information and then hit continue now your ubuntu is gonna install to your uh, drive uh, it's gonna take time wait uh, sit tight and wait and after completing this uh, you will see that uh, message so if you see that message just remove your pen drive and then hit the restart now and then you will uh, it will restart your pc and you'll see the ubuntu system is working on your system so that's it process of installing ubuntu is finished uh, completed and now your ubuntu should be work fine uh, so let's see how to fix your usb drive so for that you have to open uh, power iso again you can uh, get power iso by searching power iso here i'm using Ubu windows to do that you can also use uh, ubuntu because power iso is also available for ubuntu so i'm gonna format this drive just uh, select tools and then select clean usb drive and then hit ok and you have to wait for second and then continue unregistered and then just um, make sure you write usb drive is selected and then and just hit ok and ok again then close it now you can format your usb drive uh, before that you can close that and now just right click and then hit format you can select uh, ntfs avt or ex avt whatever you want and just hit start and then okay i got my 32 gb usb drive back so that's it for today hope you guys enjoyed that video if you do don't forget to hit the like button if you didn't subscribe yet don't forget to hit the subscribe button too and if you have any trouble on problem you can leave a comment below i will always try to help you so that's it see you in the next one